Hello traders, welcome to LH Blue. This is Defend Kobe. Uh, in this video, I'll discuss about the crude oil. So you can see this was uh, this is a crude oil and daily chart. So we have to uh, observe the daily chart first. So you can see the daily chart that trying to create the health and soldier pattern. So earlier I told that um, they are trying to create the head and soldier pattern and probability they will create the head and soldier pattern here you can see so you can uh, so this is a left soldier and this is a right shoulder and this is a head so now you can see here they are forming a neckline so i think two to three days ago i told that they are creating um, a dozy pattern below uh, near supporting line here so let me zoom here so here you can see uh, I told when they create this is a daily chart do they create a dozy pattern uh, near supporting line so they just create above the supporting line or that is why I told that crude oil will give a uh, they will the that means their retracement has completed and from this area they will start going up okay that's I think uh, when they create this one I think one two three uh, four days ago I told right so why I told here again I want to say like that so you can see I draw has supporting line here mostly supported area point here supporting resistant area point here so here you can see uh, resistant support support strong resistant and the support support and this doji is forming above little more had and so no sorry uh, hammer pattern but not exactly hammer it is called doji pattern so just above this uh, 3704 it is a daily and i think uh, remember another uh, pattern i just i drawn here so if you see in a four hour chart so here you can see um, four hour chart let me zoom so it will be very uh, visualize so uh, this was uh, right uh, this was right we people are recognize this is a hammer pattern but people are thinking it's a not a hammer it's equal both uh, but i explained that uh, why it happened like that look like a hammer right this is open this is close next open and this is close if we minus it open minus close and close minus open the candle will be like that right here why it will like open here come down open here gone up and close there that means it is like a hammer open here come down open next candle gone up close here it will be like that open and close the same price has done a little more retrace again gone up open and close are same you can see here open and close are same right so here also they are forming like that right open here came down open here gone up and close here it is look like a hammer so if they are forming like that one it is uh, it will be uh, confirming that market will go up not a hundred percent confirming uh, there is uh, there are no hundred percent perfect so it is a high probability to go up right so that is why we are entering in the market by seeing this type of indication right so you can see this was a four hour chart so now let's see in a small time frame or let's see here for next our target so uh, that is why i wanna see in a daily chart you see like this daily chart so where we have seen a target so next target here if we draw here by connecting moving average and previous supporting or resistant line so you can see here supporting a resistant line will be like that right it will be like that so i connected pbs so you can see so let me draw here so here you can see i just trying to connect the previous support and resistant line 
so that is why it will be a strong resistance so who people are trying to buy the our next target will be around 4027 or 4000 you can determine uh, like a 4000 so leave it uh, 27 point so if people uh, have a position here you just uh, count from the market around the 4000 level right so this is our target so what happened exactly uh, the moving average will be here right like that and that means if the, you can see here they have done the retracement again they will hit the previous resistance and again might give a retracement and they will create a higher low so moving average will be a strong support here from this area it will go up so they are forming like that so people are thinking oh, okay it will go continuous but not exactly like that people always doing like that zigzag right so everybody knows like that so we cannot control our emotion so that is where we have a big problem so people you must learn to control your uh, emotion clearness and greedy psychology is highly affecting in this market right so good and you can see here so that is our target so we uh, that is where we draw a line right so our target line around 4000 right so let's see in a small time frame like uh, uh, four hour is it there any resistance line no you cannot see any resistance line in a four hour here right so here you can see uh, it is a uh, little more resistance line here so that is where I draw a line here by connecting this one it is also a resistance line so previously the market is uh, market was reversed from this area as you can see market hit that area because this line also somewhere in previous data there is a support or resistance line so that is where it's happening and you can see here right now you can see the price is just uh, came down again break this area create the previous uh, support in line and again break now you can see they are becoming a resistance line right so in that area what happened exactly price might reverse again and it will next try they will try to break if they break this level so it will hit the 4000 level right so it is four hour uh, resistance line so you can see now for 15 minutes if you want to enter here so here right now you can see uh, prices running like uh, creating higher high and higher low higher high and higher low so you can see higher high higher low higher high higher low higher high higher low higher high but they create a lower high but they are not able to break this previous low and again they create a higher high so now it is a strong support by showing in four hour right around 3800 level now where is our entry point and where we will enter in this market this is a big problem of all of you all right so now we can see the where price is bouncing from so we can see here first time we have seen they bounced from 200 moving averages uh, 200 moving averages and 150 moving average you can see yesterday uh you can see this was a support that broke this support line and 200 moving average become a strong support but they create little more uh, lower right so again they start going up right so if this is really not able to continue this one i think the price will reverse to toward this 50 moving average right this one uh, green not a green uh, what is blue color this blue color color is a 30, uh, 40 minute uh, sorry 50 minute um, exponential moving average so what happened it will be now price i think if they're not really not able to continue this really so they will reverse to 50 moving average so again they will going uh, like uh, they uh, they will start going up from this 50 minute right so and another uh, what happened 
so here you can see this one we drawn this one 3898 almost 3900 okay so what exactly done they they will break this level already they broke this level they will they will give they will go a little more up right people are doing start buying from this area this is a wrong actually so after breaking these areas they will go a little more up again reverse the market who people are bought here and kept their sl just near to this supporting line they will hit the supporting line that means your sl and again they'll start going up so that is why you can see everything are confirming a uptrend in a small time frame but we'll start buying right right we are we'll buy only here but not higher point because market not going like that i always think like that not going like that the market is going like up down up down up down like that right people are buying here actually i have seen that many people are buying when price is going up there they are thinking like that gone up hey it's gone up otherwise i will miss that uh, uh, like uh, market so they start buying here the prices fell hit the sl just thinking when i bought the price came down so when they hit the sl and again start going up that is the big problem of a trader right so always you find that is the market you can see continuous going up that that means in a small time frame their price is going up right so at that time you just start buying when price is doing retest so suppose gone up price is doing retest when price is retest you will find some supporting level by moving ever as um, what call that one horizontal line diagonal line trend line or another xyz who people are using like uh, super trend or extra uh, extra different different way so when you'll find the retracement and you'll find the supporting line start buying from that area keep just sl below leave it the market one is to two or one is to five trading ratio so if you see here uh, let me show you so you can see from this area this after breaking this area 200 uh, moving average price place up trend right so who people bought here you can see yeah it broke down people are trying buying here the market crash right hit the sl and start going up right because here is a supporting line so next you can see it gone up create the higher higher uh, higher point so start buying from this area hit the sl gone up that means when price gone up and doing retracement supporting here and start buying in this area then you will get the profit right so here almost same also the price will go up doing retrace start buying this area right so i hope you enjoy this video please like and subscribe if you like this video thanks for watching